Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of Herfing with Elf. Um, tonight, I'm going to be reviewing the La Polina Black Label. I don't know if I've reviewed this yet, but it's, it's a fine cigar. Fine cigar. Um, I've run into some burn issues with it, but that may be... be because of the way I'm lighting it. It's a very dark cigar. Uh, Maduro. Um, very uh, nice cigar to smoke. Um, really throws off a lot of smoke. Really gases, as you can see. Um, even after a puff, it gases out of the cap as well. Um, tasty little cigar. Get a little sweetness, and uh, I know from smoking this before, the black pepper builds up as you're smoking it. Notice all that smoke. A friend of mine said off the foot, you smell the smoke off the foot, it smells like a Liga almost. So, um, high quality cigar for a reasonable price. Um, Looking to uh, picking some of these up. Uh, check out your brick and mortar, see if they've got them, and you know. They don't carry La Polina, yeah. You know, have to check out somewhere else, I guess I'll say. But uh, La Polina makes some good cigars, and this is one of them. Uh, if you're going to buy some, recommend this one. Oh, you get a lot of pepper through the through the nose. I brought some up, started to retrohale. Yeah, you get a lot of pepper. I really enjoy this cigar. It's when I first got them, I, I started smoking a lot of them. So they're gonna be gone in no time. So I have to look look for them again. Now that burn straightened itself out. I, I've had some of these that burn very well. Uh, very nice even burn and nice draw. It's not overly easy, you know. No draw troubles at all. The ash kind of gets a little messed up. Who knows why that is? I, I'm not sure why why they flower sometimes. You know, this sort of time. But uh, really good cigar. Get a lot of pepper. One of the troubles I have is I tend to uh, get a lot of saliva, and sometimes that that affects the draw, but that's only toward the end, typically. Um, look up some other reviews on this, though. I'm not the last word on these uh, cigars. Um, there's other reviews out there. Um, I wouldn't say you get a lot of different flavors. The pepper and the sweetness... Kind of carry you through the cigar. And the beautiful thing about it is it really gasses a lot. It burns maybe a little fast. 
Um, but if you take your time with it, you know, you can relax and enjoy it. And, you know, at a moderate price, you smoke another one. This is a cigar I don't mind smoking one after the other. I'll tell you, the weather has been great lately in upstate New York. Um, we had kind of a rainy spring, but uh, summer is turning out very nice. Uh, a little warm some days, but hey, you know, I'm not going to complain. I can sit out here and smoke. No snow, no cold weather. I think what I'm going to do is get a little better heater for my garage for the winter. So I can continue smoking uh, during the winter and continue doing these reviews. Last winter I didn't go do a, too many reviews, if I did any. Uh, but um, this winter I think I'm going to be doing more. Um, you know, as I get more cigars, try new things out, and so forth. I'll tell you, if you live in the central New York area, or even anywhere between, I'd say, Ro Albany and Rochester, Albany and Buffalo, um, Check out the local lounges here. They're very good, uh, especially Tins Tismart up in Brewerton. It's a nice little lounge, and he's always getting new cigars in. Try. Um, I don't think he has this one, but he has a number of other new cigars. I mean, he, they go to the IPCPR every year, check out the new cigars, and bring in new lines. And uh, <coughs> I think they work deals with, with other vendors and so forth and end up with a nice selection. We also have a number of nice events uh, that you can check out and uh, really nice place to go and sit down and relax and have a smoke. And get a group of friends that likes to smoke cigars and hang out with them, you know, try different cigars, uh, maybe even Start to share cigars or whatever, trade cigars, whatever. Um, turns into a fun activity. Um, I'm getting more sweetness out of this one than I've noticed in other ones, only because I just haven't, you know, I had to smoke a few to really get, get uh, the true nature of this cigar. Yeah, the retro hails aren't doing too well, but we'll get there. All right, well, another short one. Uh, well, eight minutes. Yeah. Hopefully we'll catch you next time. Uh, keep Stay tuned to my channel. I haven't been posting them on Facebook, but if you're subscribed to Herfing with Elf, you'll be able to see this video. So check, check them out, and uh, check out these black label by La Polina. <laughs>